How's it going, guys? This is Pee Wee, Pee Wee's Locker, and I have my coffee here. So, we're going to be doing podcasts now. Um, hopefully, the sound sounds good. So, let me know if it sounds loud. Let me know if it sounds low. So, next time I can fix it. So, I did a QA on um, Instagram and Facebook and YouTube. So, I got a. We're just going to do basic Q&A. This is probably going to be maybe like 5 to 10 minute video. Uh, if you like this videos, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. I think we're up maybe like 100 new subscribers this uh, month, I believe. So just keep uh, subscribing if you like the channel. And uh, yeah, thanks to all the support. I have a couple of shout outs. Uh, shout out to Jesus Mata. Um, let me see. I got a, another shout out to do. And shout out to uh, Preston Elliott. He's one of the guys that asked for a question. And then also, I believe, Kobe. Shout out to you, man. Uh, yes, for another question. Uh, not sure what y'all want to do. Y'all want to do them like Mondays or Sundays. Uh, I like Monday mornings because, you know, I could drink my coffee. And uh, let's say Sunday. I could do Sunday mornings, too. So just let me know when you want this um, to be uploaded. And, uh, yeah, guys, let's start with the first question. And uh, it's from our subscribers. Let me go ahead and uh, check them out real quick. Hopefully, y'all enjoying the day. Like I said, if y'all going to work, you know, I know I used to listen to a lot of podcasts whenever I used to go to work. So, um, let me check. Cool. So, um, our first question is, what services do you, does your business provide? Uh, whenever I started, I'm going to tell you the businesses I, pro I provided whenever I started. And then right now. Currently, my goals for 2021 on the services that we want to provide. So, um, whenever we started, we were doing lawn mowing. Um, we we're doing uh, de weeding beds, planting, uh, shrub trimming. What else? Leaf cleanups. Uh, anything that I could get my hands on. Uh, also, we used to pick up trash, like trash cleanups, um, fence cleanups. And what I what I noticed uh, whenever you do a lot of services, like you're kind of like all the way you know you, you're kind of like scattered around so like well my goals for 2021 is just to do three services so we're gonna be doing lawn mowing um we're gonna do mulching and grass installs that's it just focus on three services um i think that's for me that's a little bit better than you know like let's say we're doing mulching and we're doing shrub trimming and then we're doing tree trimming so that's a lot of services you provide um since we're a small company um you get your head wrapped wrapped around all that and you know it could just be like real bad for you and your health so like i said i'm just gonna focus on three services a lawn mowing mulching and um uh, grass installs our grass installs we start doing we started doing this in august of this year and it's been going great uh that's one of our uh main sources of income right now is doing grass installs we actually this month we profited about maybe like 3500 just on grass install so that's what i'm doing next year just focusing on that uh let me see another question is is your is landscaping your full-time job um i wouldn't call it as a job because i'm actually treating it like a business so it's my full-time business right now um yes i'm still working um i don't consider it, it is a job but i don't consider it as a job since i love what i'm doing um and um yeah man this is what i've been doing ever since march uh last year i did it uh part time and uh we were averaging on a good weekend we're averaging anywhere from 300 to 600 dollars uh part time and this was maybe like every two weeks and sometimes uh if we had like landscaping jobs let's say like building retaining walls or like uh mulching um we would average a little bit more you know so if you want to do this uh part-time you know if you have a job you're like hey you know what i just want some extra money for like shoes clothes um you know just you know for like a little vacation you could do this part-time right now i got laid off on march so from march of 2020 till now i've been doing this full time and i mean it's been working uh, <clears throat> i'm glad it happened because i could spend more time with my family uh you know i'm, I'm averaging about the same that i was making uh, working 40 hours a week right now I could average that in like two three days and I uh, still have some time for my family so 
Yeah, I'm doing this uh, full time now. How do I advertise? <clears throat> That's another question for uh, that we had um, our uh, subscribers ask. How do we advertise and how do you pick up new customers? This also falls in the same category. Um, I advertise on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Snapchat, Google. Uh, I haven't done. We do TikTok as well. I haven't done Twitter. Uh, we also do LinkedIn, the neighborhood app. <clears throat> uh, we do also what else? Um, offer up, but sometimes offer up takes down the uh, the post. So my main main resource of advertising right now is Facebook and Instagram. You could do Facebook ads. I think you could put anywhere from like five to like thirty dollars. I always put like twenty dollars a week uh, if 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 I want to advertise. And actually, it, I think it it'll advertise it on Instagram and on Facebook. I'm not sure, but um, I've been wanting to try YouTube ads and Google ads. If y'all have been doing that, let me know how that goes. Because uh, I know it's a little bit on the pricey side. I think for YouTube, monthly is anywhere from like $200 to like $300 uh, for YouTube ads. And I believe Google ads is the same. So that's what I've been doing. <clears throat> also, what has been... Um, Working for me is uh, just doing a good job on, on, on a job, you know, and, and I've been having a lot of people do word of mouth. You know, that's the old school term. That's the old school how people do it. It always works. You know, the old school techniques always work. Uh, you could pass around cards, uh, you know, flyers. It's going to work, guys. But um, how I've been doing it is just staying on social media. Um, I don't I don't want I don't want to create like a big big business in like like a quick time because i think the faster you grow it the the faster it could you know um how can you know there's a saying that says the faster you go the faster or the faster you move up the faster you'll go down so what i'm trying to do you know is just build it slow and uh just keep consistent don't try to um you know, just don't try to build it real fast. In my opinion, this is me. You could build your business however you want to build it. This is just me. I, I just, I'd rather focus on 50 customers and, you know, provide them a good service than have 500 customers and do like a shitty service, you know? So that's, that's my opinion. <clears throat> and, um, yeah, how do I pick up new customers, man? Um, just basically word of mouth is, is you know, it, it, um, uh, comes down to the same. Whenever you advertise, you get new customers. Uh, Facebook market you can do Facebook market too I think I believe you can advertise on there too for free so I do Facebook market sometimes um, mainly for the grass installs my long care uh, customers I build a relationship with them all my long care customers have been word of mouth or they they seen me cut their like their neighbor's yard and they'll come out and hey you did a good job can you cut mine um, what else family members friends friends relatives kind of like that man that's how we pick up new customers so um this is just for like the small um companies you know whenever you become a big company then you're gonna want to you know, do a lot of marketing pick up new customers through the through referrals and um you know go door, door to door flyers but like i said i just want to keep at least 50 to 60 consistent customers you know every week or bi-weekly and um yeah sometimes i post uh pictures on facebook or on instagram and there's like random people i really don't know and they'll just you know take me hey man are you, can you i need a lawn man or i need uh some mulch and you know that's how i get customers so yeah shout out to kobe uh and shout out to ruben alonso he's been growing his business really really nice uh shout out to him i believe he's doing uh painting lawns he's painting lawns so that's pretty good um and let me see. I got another question from another subscriber. So, yeah, guys, let me get a sip of this hot coffee. Mm. It's really nice, man, especially in, on this cold weather. <clears throat> so let me see. So, yeah, guys, whatever you want to watch, uh, just let me know what kind of videos I like. And, and I'll be more than glad to uh, post them. So yeah, man. Uh, shout out to um. Let me see. He had another question. This is the last question we're gonna do, guys, because it's already getting a little bit late. Not late, but I think we got maybe like eleven minutes or like nine minutes. So shout out to um 
Preston Elliott, he asked, um, how did you get your company started? So here goes, man. Um, basically, how I got my company started, uh, my wife at the time, she was pregnant. And then, um, you know, I, I was she was not going to work. So I was looking for another stream of income. So uh, I had my machines, man. I've been doing lawn care ever since I was 13. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and try it out, see if it works. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. So, uh, I mean, I'm like, I already got the machines. I have nothing to lose. So um, I had my blower, my weed eater, and my uh, my mower. My mower, my weed eater, and my blower. Sorry about that. I just had a brain fart. But, um, yeah, man, I did that. I posted ads on uh, OfferUp. That's whenever OfferUp didn't take out the ads. So I did that, um, and I had, I had this lady. She... Um, she actually um she messaged me she's like hey how much will you charge me for this uh and and and, and take note i mean I, I used to do lawn care but i never knew pricing so when i got there it was like i think it was like an acre property and i was like hey you know what i'll just charge you 50 bucks so you could actually check the uh the video our first video that's the property we mowed for 50 dollars um you could check it out um so i'll put a link down below that's how we started man um and you know, I charge you 50 bucks. I was happy with those $50. Um, you know, I think those $50 helped me out for like groceries or something like that or for like gas. So it was good. And then, um, yeah, man, it just took off after that. Um, I bought my little trailer. And then after that, once I started getting me with like 10, 15 consistent customers, I was like, hey, well, you know what? I need to invest in a zero turn. So I invested in a zero turn. And then uh, I started getting like 25, 30 customers. And, you know, I just started going up from there. Currently, right now, we have maybe like 50 consistent customers. So, um, like I said, I just want to keep it between 50 and 60, you know, just uh, focus on those customers, bring them a good value. Now, whenever I'm like, you know what, I want to grow my business more, then that's whenever we're going to start, you know, you know, getting crews and all that. So, yeah, man, that's how I basically started. Uh, it, it actually just started as a joke, man. And I mean, we've 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 been growing it ever since uh, 2000, since last year. So I mean, it's been growing slowly but surely. Like I said, whenever you start a business, you always want to take baby steps, man. Don't try to like, uh, man, you know what? I started my lawn care company. I want to get my first commercial property. I want to do this. But this, you know, that's my. Uh, that's my suggestion to y'all if you want to start a business start it out slow because uh if you start it off real fast uh the faster you go up the faster you go down so you know just keep going go up you know stay there go up it's like a ladder so that's how i uh that's how i uh preach it you know so yeah guys that's it man if you like this video like comment and subscribe like I said, we got maybe like 100 new subscribers, so go ahead and keep subscribing, guys, so I can keep making these videos. If you have any video requests you want me to do, um, I'll go get, uh, I'll give y'all a shout out and do the video. Um, so yeah, man, let's just keep growing this long community and stay positive and have a nice, nice weekday.